Hello everybody and welcome back. I'm World Dragon and we are continuing our playthrough of the demos available to us on Steam's Next Fest. As you can see, we are looking at Wool at the Gate. We, I think we're going to be defending ourselves against a horde of sheep from the uh, picture I've pretty much seen. Once again, I have no idea how to play these games. I have no idea what's in these games. I am coming at these from a completely fresh perspective as I believe, as I've said before with these, that all games should be intuitive. Okay, so Tutorialia. That's what we're gonna play. Um, high score, threshold, unlocks, play. That's the button we're looking for. Use thingies to move. Sheep have gone crazy, prepare your city's defense. Oh, here's my eyeball. Hold shift to sprint to build your HQ and become a hero. Ah! Protect your HQ at all costs. If you lose, if your HQ is destroyed, the flag indicates your hero's classes. Your starting class is warrior. Okay. Press space to change forms. Use the I form to quickly... To move quickly and heal. Use the hero form to fight and execute hero abilities. Okay. Enemies approaching soon. We lose if our HQ is destroyed. Lamb. Weak melee... Enemy that attacks anything it can. Fairly harmless, except in large flocks. Let's begin the round. Okay, let's try and keep it so there's only one of them attacking me. Hey, you come back here. Healing eyeball, get him! Alright, whirlwind activated! Round survived! Let's become an eyeball and heal back up! Build houses generate gold each round! Put down as many houses as I can. Yep, which is what I'm supposed to be doing. Five houses. Find your houses to protect your city's economy. Destroyed buildings will be rebuilt but won't provide resources that round. It's going for round two. Protected 100% time bonus. Okay, we got good score. Build a shrine to instantly gain one spirit and generate one spirit each round. Okay, let's build a whole bunch of shrines. Go to barracks to recruit troops and help defend your city. Barracks incur upkeep, which costs one gold each round. Choose your troops. Each troop belongs to two classes. When you gain enough class points of the same type, all troops, towers, and heroes of the class get a class power bonus. Well, do you know what? Let's... Melee unit that can heal nearby en enemies, or sorry, allies. Wizard, Ranger Mage, Warrior Enchanter, Warlock Summoner, Mercenary Berserker. Alright, we're going to get some archers. Move while selecting to grab as many troops as you want. Oh. Come to there. Done.
Use hold position to keep troops from straying too far from a location. This is especially useful for ranged troops. Start the next round. Come on, you darn sheep. Only just survived. Build towers to improve your defenses and gain class points. Towers incur upkeep, which cost one gold each round. Choose a tower. Grave robber. Digs up one gold and three summoned at the start of the round. Digs up three more summoned each time you use respawn troops ability. Shoot AOE projectile that slow enemy movement and attack speed for a short time period. Cast an enchanter spell and next attack deals bonus damage based on damage taken. We're going to go for the good old archer. Choose a perk. Your HQ towers and barracks cost one less gold to upgrade and give you an additional faction point when upgraded. Houses now explode when destroyed, dealing damage to nearby enemies, higher level houses. Gain two class points in your hero's primary class and your hero does 35% more damage. All barracks gain a powerful long-range attack and have 100% more health. Mm. HQ towers and barracks upgrades cost one less gold. Need more spirit to build another tower. Oh god, it upgraded shrine instantly gets um, power points. We're going to go for this one. I'm going to go for the Grave Robber. I think I'm just about out of everything. Let's start the next round. Woo! It's a bit dangerous in there. Get out of here! Use iPhone to heal. Yes, of course. Okay, we have... We have 40 followers turning up. Greater barracks to get more troops and increase how many troops the barrack can respawn at once. Build another barracks to get more troops and gain class points. Need a unit that can heal nearby at... Allies, I think. Model troop types need to be selected. Cancel and try again. Build a troops to command one at a time. Okay. Now press this to position troops. Uh, hang on, I want these guys. You come to there. You guys get out of here. Oh no, I lost one paladin. That's a shame. One more just respawned though, so that's all good. 
Your towers and barracks can cut upkeep that costs gold each round. Upgrade houses to improve your economy. We are not actually getting a lot of gold. Can upgrade one more. Nice, that's now going to be 10 gold per round. Now press to select all troops by type. Oh, nice. You can escape to cancel. Position your troops and prepare for battle. Have you guys roughly stay there this time? Got a Philly! these range guys no my tower How dare you destroy my tower okay that's back up it's aoe projector that slows enemy movements and not great temporarily disabled by tutorial how dare you raid your hq and make it stronger and gain a new hero ability Shoot up to 8 enemies, dealing 15% of the target's max health and damage and reducing attack and movement speed. Can just 8 summoned to help you fight? I quite like that. Mercenary bonus gains. Place a large trap on the ground. The first enemy to walk into the trap will activate it for 6 seconds. Nice. As does now explode. Have you guys counterattack bonus damage gained damage over time bonus gained? Ah, yeah, here are all my bonuses. Fantastic. Uh, what do I have in terms of money? Can I? No, I can't upgrade. Might just go and. Okay, can upgrade. Temporary available. Unavailable. Due to the wonderful tutorial. Step into my trap. Ha 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 Take that! Take that, you fiends! Use building previews to quickly view building options. Upgrade temporarily disabled. I'll press Alt. When ready, hold something to start the next round. You're free to build and upgrade whatever you want from here. Experiment with new buildings like walls for defenses and temples for your economy. Let us have... Get a few more temples online, and then I'm gonna get one more barracks. And we're gonna go and grab the wizards.
Okay, we haven't got much left. I can afford another tower, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. And cast an enchanted spell that increases the attack speed of all towers in range. I'll grab another grave robber. Very nice, and then let us start this round. All of you stay in that range. <laughs> Oh, that was a bit premature. I wasn't quite in the middle of all of them. Nice. Generate your health 100% faster when I form. Deal airy damage at your landing location when entering hero form and take 50% reduced damage for 3 seconds. Reduced. Towers, walls, and your HQ have 40% more health and take 40% less damage. I'm going to go for the improved eyeball. Upgrade that tower. Let's go and put some walls down. And with my remaining money, let's go and grab our last type of troops. I think that makes it done, done, and done. All right, let's get into this next round. Carving them up. Take that, you evil wool. All right, how did I do? Oh, I only got. I got three eyeballs! And we stayed at three eyeballs. I have unlocked orcs. I don't know if that's people I can use or people that are... I assume they're not going to attack me because last I knew orcs don't have wool on them. Uh, but we're actually just going to leave that there, to be honest with you. That's pretty much a look at what the game is. You fly around as a giant eyeball, you build up a little army, and you defend yourselves against hordes and hordes of woolly animals. And so with that, ladies and gentlemen, let's leave to say thank you very much for joining us at this quick look at wool at the gates. And until we see you again, wherever that may be, as for always, I hope that you can stay safe, happy, and healthy. <laughs>